Hellions, good morning. Starting out today at Office Depot, right there in my hand. I got the whole Office Depot in my hand. Oh, it's so heavy. The older I get, the more I realize that some of the stuff that I used to use when I was a kid that we don't use anymore because of technology, some of you guys may not know about. And one of the items is carbon paper. It's kind of like ghost paper. Carbon paper is so awesome. Essentially what you do is you take one sheet of this, like it shows right there, and you put it between this sheet here. And you know, this sheet and this sheet has to be like basically the same. And then you write on this one and press down and it transfers what you write from the top to the bottom sheet. Freaking ingenious, right? I know, it's been around for ages. Okay, so I just got through doing my first mobile diagnostic. <laughs> and, and, I'm sorry. <laughs> and my first credit card payment. So that was kind of cool. She's like, can I pay you with a check? And I'm like, um, I think credit cards. Ooh, I can do that. Yes. Checks are bad, okay? Who writes checks? Do you guys still write checks? I think the only thing that checks are good for nowadays is to, uh, <laughs> so that you got something that lists your routing number and your checking account number. So when you're asked for it, for like a bill pay or something online, you have that information available. What? Why are you chasing me? Get him. Now I'm going to chase you. And that doesn't work. Watch this. Oh, daddy's down. Oh, daddy's down. Get him. Not me. <laughs> Get daddy. Come here. Get me. Get daddy. Get me. Come here. <laughs> he says, no, I want to get everybody except daddy. Get daddy. Oh. So he gets daddy. You guys ever lay in the grass and after you lay in the grass you got like grass itchies? <laughs> what is that? Whoa. Bubbles. <laughs> I almost inhaled the bubble. <laughs> Woo, bubbles. Bubble. <laughs> oh, gosh. Did you eat it? It tastes like soap. Okay. <laughs> yes, I am. Oh, wow. It's awesome to see how pianos are assembled, though. I mean, it's just not these keys right here. It's this whole long arm using a fulcrum in the center, and this hits this, and that hits this, making that hit this. And it's like, oh my goodness. Pianos are ingenious. <laughs> ah! I didn't scare him at all. <laughs> it's like his own it's like his own little tent. Until he falls. He already has. Are you goofy? All done? All done? No. No? Uh oh. Here, here, you do it, because I, I won't be able to see it. You do it. Point it out to The them. Grim Reaper is staring at me. I don't see it. Look, he's got a smile on his face here. There's the eyes. Here's his arm going up here, and he's holding the sky. Right there, here's the blade. See it? Blade. See him holding it? Here's his body. And here's his other arm. Here, here's his legs. One, two. All oh, here's the rib cage. Back up to here to his face. And he's smiling. There's a nose, eyes, arm, elbow up here, holding the sky. And there's the blade. It even looks like there's like a whipping motion. That's creepy! He's staring at me! Oh my god, get it away from me! <laughs> I sat down to stretch out my back and the Grim Reaper is staring at me! <laughs> and Phoenix is taking protection in his shelter. Look at right there! 
I thought he was gonna go nuts like airplane, 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 moon, 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 bird, bird, train. Well, he already did the moon thing. <laughs> he was like moon, moon, bye moon, bye moon. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm stripping the piano, which is illegal, <laughs> which is illegal in all 50 states and Hawaii. What? Uh, right. <laughs> and um, so anyway, I'm hoping to find some buried treasure in it. And so far, I found a colored pencil and a guitar pick. But I mean, you have to think about it. From 1948, this is an old piano. 1948, Smith and Barnes upright, uh, number one four five five three zero. Just FYI. No ivory keys. All right, guys, here's something else I found, and I haven't touched it yet. You guys are the first ones to see this. I don't know what it is. It's got a hole in it, so I don't think it's all that good. It's aluminum, good for 10 cents when returned with bottle. HK Todd and Company, 608. I don't know. That's weird. Huh. Huh. It looks like a redemption token. I've never even seen such a thing. Oh god, wouldn't that be cool if it's like ten thousand dollars? Oh, and I found a couple of worthy what do you call these things? Bobby pins, I think. That's kind of cool. Wow, I thought this was just a plastic disc in here, like a playing piece or a checker, or I don't know, something weird. But I bring it up and I see this. It's like, oh my gosh, Warren Spawn Milwaukee Braves. Warren Spawn, born April 1921, blah, 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 1954. I wonder if this is worth anything. Holy crap, this is like the second thing. That's awesome. I'm finding history. Oh, and I found another one of these little bobby pin things. And I found some spider webbing. And I found an easier way to take these out since they just screw in. You hold on to them, you get them started, and then you just helicopter it. And it flies off. It's awesome, and it's fun. Not really. It's fun the first three times. And I just found a penny. I haven't uh, looked to see what it is yet. Oh, this is that's new. Well, new being 1979, but also not being worth anything. Are you walking in daddy's shoes? Eh! Dad, <laughs> mama, I just die. Whoop him. <laughs> Baby vlogging, look at that. Good boy. Mama. That's mama. <laughs> Hi, baby. He, he seriously has full control of the camera right now. Ah. <laughs> now turn it around on yourself. Aim it at yourself. Turn it around so you can see Phoenix. Like this. Turn it around like this and say, Hi guys. Hi guys. And say, Hi guys, I'm Phoenix. Hi Nick. <laughs> Before we get into COC, I would like to give a special thank you to everybody who has donated to the Patreon account. It really, really means a lot. Um, I have changed something on it though. I've got a goal on there now. Why is this relevant? Well, this is relevant because this camera right here, <laughs> it's getting old. The shutter is starting to not open all the time and the screen has been cracked for a while. And the other thing about it too is, and I, I don't know why, but the images to me seem like they've been like washed out a lot, especially like lately within the last several months. So I'd like to get a new camera. Um, and that would, of course, continue this, and it falls within the lines of the creator and everything, um, uh, the, the, the whole reason why Patreon is there. Along with helping with this job transition or whatever, because things haven't been easy, and now <laughs> they're, they're I, don't, I really don't want to say, because I try to stay upbeat about things. If anybody knows anything about this, because I did some research on it tonight, and I think that this is worth some money. I looked on eBay, and they did not have the black one. Uh, apparently, it comes in different colors. Um, this is a 1955 uh, coin, even though it says 54 on the back. This is a 1955 armor coin because it came in packs of hot dogs, the old armor hot dogs. 
Hot dogs, armor hot dogs. I think that this is worth like more than 30 bucks. Possibly a hundred, I don't know. I was not able to find any information on this right here, which means that it is either super rare or it's not worth anything. Except the scrap aluminum. Now for cock. Cap zone two. That white building, the Smith Tower, was the tallest building west of the Mississippi River. Yes, absolutely, you are correct, and I should have known that. And then, um, apparently, there's an apartment on top that is um, that somebody lives in. So, Lori Lee posted an article, a very interesting read there, or uh, video, rather. John John 9111 you did change your name back to the old one. That's awesome. Um, my question, though, is, what does your name mean? I'm curious for the extra one. Upon the frogs, are you staying with a group of friends at West Coast Hunters Convention? Hope we get to meet you. Um, right now, quite honestly, it's up in the air. I've been trying to, because the hotel's full. So, it may be a sign. I don't know. I don't want to stay at the, there's another hotel that's close by, but I really don't want to stay there. Um, so, I don't know. Uh, I'm working on that. Adam Owens, our Rainforest Cafe in Dallas also has an alligator, but it looks so realistic. Yeah, I was thinking about it today. They need to um, redo the paint job on it because it's starting, it doesn't, it looks pretty cheesy. <laughs> Jordan Winton, it's neat to see on Instagram or Facebook what you're doing. I'm like, Lord, what are they up to today? <laughs> Happy haunting. That's cool. Um, I didn't post anything today. Shame on me. Oh, I should have posted the coin. I'll do that now. I'll do that now I'm thinking of it because it'll still be up before the vlog. <laughs> Dark Legion 75, you're a pretty good tour guide. Maybe you could add that or something related to it to the list of possibilities now in front of you. <laughs> and Lori Lee said, didn't anyone get my speed reference? And Jeremy Chenoweth says, love speed, nice reference. It's so funny, I was editing the vlog and it was like, it, it just, it just, I don't know. When it was happening live, it was kind of like, oh my god, there's the bus. I could have jumped out onto the bus. Although the car would have crashed, that would have been bad, but you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Underworld Haunted House, the troll trolled you. Alright guys, thanks for watching, happy haunting, see you guys tomorrow. Uh, maybe we'll find more stuff in the piano if I if I do anything with the piano tomorrow. Because there's still like, there's still nooks and crannies in that thing. And I was surprised to find this stuff, so that's pretty cool. Alright guys, happy haunting, see you tomorrow. I don't think this is the Hellmouth anymore, Toto.